Well, I've been living in Oxford for 10 years now. Um, so I came to university in Oxford, um, at Oxford Brooks. Um, I've been living in different houses the entire time, but I've been working and living here. I'm doing some study as well. And those shoes, I bought them because I was on holiday at the time. I was in Boston, in America, um, about three years ago. And I bought them because they kind of reflected my, my favourite colours. So that's why I bought them. And uh, I bought them thinking, yeah, you know, these could be something I could wear every day and they could keep me going for a long time. Um, and actually they did, they lasted almost three years. And I recently thought, oh, I have to, you know, get rid of them and, and that's where they've kind of come through, so. The distance between here and probably Boston is probably the far farthest I've travelled. Um, I don't really know, unfortunately, but I, don't, I do know that obviously I bought them in Boston, started wearing them in Boston in, in, in America, so that's where they kind of, they've been the furthest from home. I've, I think they've always been with me, so there's no specific special experience, but they're kind of, they kind of represent my favourite kind of colours, which is red and black, and I like those colours because they're ones quite One's quite fiery, and then the other's a bit kind of standard. But um, I look forward to seeing friends, um, doing things that are going out and meeting people and doing practical, exciting activities. Um, things I'm not usually looking forward to are kind of, you know, boring things like having to, to manage bills and payments and stuff and all that kind of stuff really. But um, I appreciate Oxford's architecture its history, um, the buildings, kind of the designs of that kind of stuff. Um, I really appreciate the parks. I've tried to um, understand many people and how they experience the world. I feel that people like like um, what you were saying about um, understanding each other is important. I think a level of, of, of kind of respect and empathy and, and kind of being working together is a huge element of, of who we are and we're quite social beings anyway so I think just really trying to understand another person's point of view when you're feeling you know perhaps blocking yourself and actually when you meet someone and they're finding it very you know they're finding something very hard just understanding what they're, they're believing in is, is really important and I think just being there for a person is, is, a, is a huge thing and actually can give a lot. I feel um, my way of going through life is um, walking, like you know, on a path, um, seeing many crossroads ahead. But before I get to that crossroad, I always think about where that's going next, and then making a decision about where I'm going. Um, and then when I get to the crossroads, I've already had a, th a thought about where, which one I'm going to take. Um, and then I'm, I'm, I'm quite certain on that path, but those options are still there if I want them to be. I would like to leave traces on people's experiences in the context of, you know, people going from a place where they weren't happy or upset or sad to a place where actually they were benefited or helped in some way. Um, not necessarily by me, but stuff that I can offer. Um, as a person and actually make people's lives better. Um, that I'm open-minded, um, that I will offer a caring, friendly person, um, someone who will understand as much as I can. Um, but obviously I'm, I'm one of those people who will um, be very much like, I'll, I'll be able to because I have, I have lots of things on my plate usually, and I usually try and give as much time as I possibly can to people, but obviously looking after myself. So being quite boundary, I think, is important. I think my new shoes do represent a lot of my kind of, my work, where I'm going with stuff. Um, the shoes that I wear now, at this moment, are shoes that I wear most times and actually will come with me on, on various aspects of life, probably traveling, um, but there's other things that are kind of inhibiting my ability to travel at the moment because um, I recently, you know, um, found a new house. Um, but hopefully these are the shoes that I'd be wearing when going on my adventures and, and doing those things that I do in life, so like work and, and traveling. I wish for me to be 
further in my career. Um, hopefully looking to start a family perhaps.